you do that first, then you can uh, carry on with this uh, video. Well guys, um, in this little clip, um, if you excuse the mess, my wife's commandeered the uh, workshop because of a potential car boot sale coming up, so uh, I've got no space to do anything. Um, but uh, yeah, back to this little clip, it's only a five minute job. Um, a lot of you have been getting letters about these uh, recall for uh, a plastic plug to be replaced with an aluminium plug uh, for the activated charcoal uh, drainage plug. Um, just a, a quick heads up on that one. Um, it carries a risk of uh, fire if it's not replaced, if you read the letter. Um, I'll put an example of the letter up on the screen. Um, but essentially, um, this activated charcoal just captures fuel vapours from the fuel tank when not in use. Um, all the vapours get caught and stored in the uh, charcoal. And uh, when the engine is started, uh, the vacuum uh, sucks through all those vapours and pushes it through into the air fuel mixture um, which then gets burnt as part of running your bike basically. Um, so all that um, fuel vapour which is caught in the activated charcoal um, that's the drainage hole, drainage pipe which that plug, uh, the plastic plug is currently uh, what the bike comes with at the bottom that KTM have found that there's a risk of fire if that's not replaced, hence they are doing this major recall. Um, it's a five minute job, it literally is just take it out, put it back in and make sure the uh, aluminium one's in place because as you'll see, it's very close to the uh, downpipe and that downpipe gets so hot. Um, I could understand that uh, carrying a risk of melting that plastic plug. Um, unfortunately, KTM wouldn't let me have the plastic plug uh, to take away with me, uh, which is understandable, I guess, because they're swapping it under warranty. They hold on to the bits they take off. Um, but I'll show a photo um, of the uh, the old one compared to the new one. I must say the new aluminium one is a lump of metal. I mean, it does actually weigh. Uh, it weighs about, uh, if, I want to... if I had seven pound coins in my hand, it probably weighs about the weight of seven pound coins compared to just a bit of plastic they took out. Um, but you know, it is what it is. Um, makes the bike safer and there's no risk of uh, basically adios muchachos um, if the bike does kind of uh, ignite through uh, a melting drainage hose pipe. I don't know what the chances of that are, but I'm sure they're wanting to eliminate as much risk as possible. Um, but yeah, I'll show you what it is. And uh, it was just a heads up for those people thinking, what the hell is the recall? What is this activated charcoal? Um, is it such a big deal? Obviously, is if they're saying your bike is at risk of basically catching fire. <laughs> anyway, cheers. Right, that's the activated charcoal drainage plug. That bit there, as you can see, it's now metal. There's a clamp around it at the end of the plug, um, but that bit's metal now. And that's the bit that's close to the uh, exhaust, uh, the manifold. Uh, 